And what about the emotions of this being your last year? <clears throat> yeah, I don't, I don't see much. There's, we're not talking about it. We're not delving into it very much. Uh, they know it. I know it. And uh, but it's business as usual. And that's the, they, they deserve my undivided attention on every single bounce, shot, defensive possession that, that I can give to them. And that's what we'll be talking about what, every day. Do you, do you give Aaron any extra responsibilities just to help? transition him into the role a little bit? You know, I think Aaron's really understanding of exactly what is in store for him uh, for a lot of different reasons. He, he was a phenomenal player here, uh, a great pro. He's been terrific in his years here at Temple as uh, one of the assistant coaches. I give a lot of responsibility to all of them. Uh, he's got some increased duties in that he and I are talking all the time about where we are with different things, whether it's personnel or recruiting or whatever else we all do. But it's just in anticipation of him doing everything that he's going to do uh, starting in April or May or whatever it will be, the, the transition will take place. But it's been a, a smooth transition. I'm very proud of him, proud of our, our all of our staff. I think these guys are really understanding of what, what it takes to be college basketball coaches 